Hello and welcome to Longship Gaming. Today we're playing Marvel Champions. It's going to be Rocket Raccoon versus Ronin. So, playing through this year all of our heroes and villains uh, as close to alphabetically as possible. We have now come to one of the, the bigger challenges in the game. And that would be Ronin, top tier difficulty villain. Uh, so I went onto the old Marvel Champions database, found a relatively recent uh, fun-looking and powerful Rocket Raccoon deck. It's Leadership. Uh, I will link to the deck in the description below and credit the author as usual. But it uh, basically takes advantage of the fact that Rocket Raccoon is a genius on his alter ego side. And in that sense, he can then leverage Moon Girl. And we can leverage Moon Girl and be able to recur her over and over and over again with Suit Up. Uh, so we can get things like Clarity of Purpose out off of Suit Up with Moon Girl. Uh, Ingenuity is important again because we are a genius, so we can play that on our um, alter ego side. Um, we have Nick Fury here. We've got Professor X, although right off the bat, of course, with Ronan having the universal weapon, we cannot confuse him right away. Uh, so there's going to be a lot of setting up um, before we can really take advantage of um, some turns where you can recur Moon Girl over and over and over and over again and just uh, generate tons and tons of card draw. And it, it helps with Rocket too. Once he's expended charges off of one of his guns, you can always sacrifice that gun for even more card draw. We've got Avengers Mansion in here as well. So hopefully... It goes well. It's likely to be a, a, a long one, uh, a bit of a long drawn out one to say the least. I did play one practice game of this um, and it turned out okay. We just got really, really, really unlucky with the card draw that ended the game. So, and no, it was not dying to fanaticism. It was instead getting schemed out on um, in one of those sequences of um, cards generating or having him scheme uh, far more frequently than is reasonable at any point in the game. Okay, so we are going to get shuffled up and we'll be right back to see if that scrappy Rocket Raccoon can take on Ronin. Alright, we're back. We're shuffled up. We have our starting six cards. We have Reload, Honorary Guardian. I've got a plan. CITT, Suit Up, and Professor X. Okay. Um, well, Reload's not going to do us any good because we don't have any weapons. Honorary Guardian. Um, not particularly useful at the moment. I've got a plan. Uh, could be useful. Rocket does have a two thwart. He could actually thwart everything off of these schemes right away. But we do have access to the Milano on turn one. Oh, he's already, he can scheme, he can get rid of the threat off of cut the power right away. So yeah, I don't think we need to do, I've got a plan. CITT. Tempting, but that feels late game. Suit up, very important, and Professor X. Not right now. So, we're one, two, three, four, five. Really hard mulliganing here to see if we can get Moon Girl. Rocket's Pistol, Major Victory, Nowhere, Reload, Moon Girl. Okay, so we got Moon Girl, but she's in our hand. Let's see. If we use Moon Girl to pay for Pistol... Um, I 
Then we're not really going to use suit up, and we're only going to get two off of Moon Girl. No. I think we just pay for her outright. Suit up's not really going to do us anything here. Okay. So. Um, yeah, suit up doesn't work. Reload. Oh, no, we need to spend... Major victory. And the Milano. Let's put a Moon Girl to draw two. Not the best rate, but it's okay. Um, well, we're going to be able to thwart everything, so that's fine. Um... Two, pay for nowhere, and then bring out Rocket's pistol just so we have one of his weapons available. Uh, we're going to flip over. We will thwart, cut the power. We will thwart... Interception imminent. And we'll pop the tough off of him. Now, the other question is, do we want to get rid of universal weapon? Don't think we do quite yet. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Make the call. Suit up. Ingenuity, energy, and genius. Okay. Hmm. This might be an interesting next turn. So, to go on, he's going to attack. He's going to attack for a base of four. We'll have Moon Girl get in the way. Uh, and it will be two cards because we have the Power Stone. So that's more than enough to take out Moon Girl. But that's good because this is exactly where we want Moon Girl to be. To be able to suit up. But we have to be... In genius mode to do it. Wonder if that's worth it. We'll see. Okay. Um, first encounter card. Surge exhaust. I think we're okay with exhausting. It's going to surge, though. It's surging. And then we have Rogue Vessel. And that's not one that we can cancel with the Milano. So we have two more. Again, surge. He gets his tough back. So still have two. So, so far we've drawn... <laughs> three, when it should only have been two. Okay, Cree Commando, Dark Designs, and then he's going to scheme. Okay, uh, so he's scheming for three, four. So that was, uh, that was pretty awful. Um, or hold on a second, maybe... That was a treachery. So we have to exhaust the Milano 
Yeah, we're not going to make the call, so it's going to go. Okay. Okay. So we will ignore Sinister Strike. And this is a very rough start for us, to say the least. Okay. Uh, villain phase ends, so we take a damage off of Rogue Vessel. Let's uh, ping the commando for two. So we have to get rid of uh, I think we need to go find ourselves a guardian. And I think that's going to have to be suit up. We're going to go get Gamora. Oh, and we need um, something that we could put on her. Let's see. She's going to attack. Yeah, we're going to draw a card off of... What do we want to bring back in hand? I think we're going to bring back Honorary Guardian. So that'll come to hand. Um, pay for Gamora. That's going to draw us a card. Salvage? Okay. She will attack Commando. Discard for an event. Schadenfreude. Yeah, it was a problem that we lost access to the Milano to stop the rogue vessel from hitting us. We're going to lose control of this anyway. We know it's going to flip. It always does. So I think, and since I can't remove any threat off of it, I think I don't really have much of a choice but to flip down. I'm going to discard the pistol and draw two. I have a response, particle cannon, okay. Um, let's play ingenuity.
and then use Ingenuity to play for the Particle Cannon. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cosmo Avengers Mansion, suit up, helicarrier, battery pack, Murray Hill. Okay, now here's an opportunity then for us to leverage our resources to get Moon Girl back in the game again. Okay. Two threat goes on. He's going to scheme. Scheming for three, four. So that's going to immediately flip it over. Oops. He gets the power stone. Commando is going to scheme. First encounter card. Crisis on half world. Okay, now. Do we need to be standing up? No. Second one. Pincer maneuver. Okay. All right, we have a lot to contend with here. I think we can do it. Uh, we're gonna take another damage from the rogue vessel. Okay, so. We need one more resource to be able to play Moon Girl. So, okay, so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to take out the, the commando. Go looking for an event. Blaze of Glory. Uh, we're going to use Cosmo and Blaze of Glory. Let's pay for Suit Up. So let me go looking for Moon Girl. And wherever I put honorary guardian, there it is. Okay, and the tricky thing here is that we have to play oh, you know what? Instead of playing Cosmo, we're going to play Maria because we need to have. Cosmo in hand. Okay. So. One. Two. For Cosmo. To draw.
Okay. Now, the question is, We need to get rid of pincer maneuver because it's just awful for us, to say the least. So I think we try and spend most of it out of hand. One, two, three. We'll use Groot's wild card as genius. One, two, three. Okay. Not terrific. We could get everything off of pincer maneuver by playing Nick. That's what I think we're going to do, get more card advantage. So I think that was an okay draw. Draw three. Okay. Cosmo, we're going to thwart Pincer Maneuver. Uh, we're going to name Treachery. No, nope, it was a minion. That's one off of there. And then we'll have... Moon Girl and Nick. Or the rest off of pincer maneuver. Uh, we'll spend salvage. I think I forgot with salvage to put a tech card back on the top, like I should have last time I spent it. Put out this pistol. Um, it's no tech. We'll hold on to reload. We will ping the tough off. And then we will shoot him for four. Which then gets the power stone back. Okay, we're holding on to that, and I think we're done. Oh yeah, we had to flip over to do that, so we're back on rocket side. Okay. One, two, three, four. Maria, battery pack, major victory, clarity of purpose, and reload. Okay. So, two are going to go on here. He's going to attack. He's attacking for four. Uh, we're going to have Nick get in the way. Six, seven, a lot. <laughs> Nick got blown up. Okay. Master plan. Um... 
We want we got to get rid of rogue vessels, so I'm just going to let that go through. Go look for a side scheme. Okay, we know one fanaticism is gone. Oh, other fanaticism, pincer maneuver. Okay, it's not that hard for us to deal with. Second one, blind side. Uh, we're gonna stun. Okay, and then the end of that, we take a damage. So, first things first. Thwarting for three, so we can do that. We can get rid of pincer maneuver. Lost the Milano, spend two resources to get rid of Rogue Vessel. Um, play out Clarity of Purpose, because it's just so good. We're going to fire off the pistol, just to get rid of the stun. We will hit Ronin for four. Let's start out by thwarting with Cosmos, so a treachery. Yes, so it doesn't take any damage from that. That's good. Now, Maria or Major? I feel like... Oh, I didn't have to get rid of Powerful Cannon. It can stay. And I wonder if on this turn I flip back down again. Uh, no, um, yeah, I'll do Maria. She has the higher thwart. Okay. Thwart for two. I think it's a bit safe to flip down to be able to heal. Uh, Gamora will thwart the last one off, so then we go looking for an event. So we got, I've got a plan. Everything's off of that. Good. Now we're going to flip down. We're going to sacrifice the Parco Cannon, draw two. Oh, okay. Well, I think it's a perfect time to suit up since we have to do an alter ego. Believe I did that right last time. No, not make the call. I guess I have to go looking for it. Yep. Pretty sure I didn't mess that up. If I did, let me know in the comments. Be an easy enough one to fix. Okay. So for next turn, we'll have all that available. Okay. That's in our hands. 
untap already everything I should say we're not playing magic one two three four Yeah, I think I may have messed that up by going to get Gamora. I don't, it's too late now. I don't remember. Okay. Well, whatever. It happened. It's done. So I have Honorary Guardian. Moon Girl, Battery Pack, Pistol, Rocket Launcher, Thruster Boots. Oh, jeez. All is tech now. Okay. Uh, so two, three gone. He's going to scheme. He's going to scheme for three. One counter goes on to pursue by the pass. So only three. That's all right. First encounter card, Creek Commando, second one. I got a lot of meat to chew through here. And now he's going to start accelerating already because we've that uh, master plan really messed with us since I got rid of, felt like half his deck. Okay, so we've got a a lot of work to do, especially since we have these awful patrols out here. So I don't think I'm going to be able to heal like I was going to. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to burn Rocket's pistol. Then... To... Three, Moon Girl, draw three, one, two, three. Wow, we have like all of his tech now, which means lots of weapons. Okay. Don't have reload, so there's only so much we can do. Oh no, we do have reload, okay. Um, so, Genius and Honorary Guardian to bring out the rocket launcher. Let's get Rocket's Skeleton out. Put out Battery Pack. No. Put out... Oh, no, I can do both. That's fine. Yeah, put out battery pack. Oh, no, I can't. Hold on.
Yeah, put out his pistol. <sighs> Flip to the hero side. So an attack of two. So first thing to do, since I'm going to be firing all these off. Okay, so. Two damage, so two to Ronin, and then two to each commando. Then Oh yeah, I already knew I was going to fire that. Two to that commando. Then... Reload. Rocket launcher again. So I can stay there. Kills that commando. Oh, um... This should have been shuffled first before the commandos go away. Okay. Uh, two more to this one. And then just completely gun them down. That's good. Thwart to Cosmo. Let's choose treachery again. Is it treachery? So he's still around. So it go down. It goes down to two, and then Maria can do the last two to get everything off of it. That was quite the turn. Uh, and then I guess I'll just attack for two. That was, uh, that was all right. Problem, of course, with Ronan is that he can come back out of nowhere and usually does. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nope, five. Strength, I've got a plan, make the call, rapid response, blaze of glory. Okay. Interesting. Three threat go on. He's going to attack. Uh, we're going to Moon Girl get in the way. So it's an attack of four, five. Uh oh, this has overkill. Six, seven. Uh, so six are going to go through. Oh, see, told you. That was not great. Oh, I didn't give myself the extra three. Oh, what was I at? Oh, no, I got hit for... Seven, so I already gave it to myself off of Seven X Kelton. Oh, should have been an extra damage because I did three. Okay. First encounter card. <laughs> Another Kree Commando. Single Minded Fury. Oh, God. Okay, Cosmo. Okay. Now things have gotten a bit rough, to say the least. What can we do here? We can't thwart because of the commando. We could make the call. I 
That was a treachery, though. Yeah, it wouldn't have mattered. Okay. So I have to heal this turn, or it's over. So... Blaze of Glory doesn't do anything for me. <sighs> do we go get Gamora? I probably do. Okay. So... Make the call. Um, using, I've got a plan in Blaze of Glory. Oh, and rapid response. Yeah. Uh, she's guardian, so draw a card. So suit up, interesting. That opens up some possibilities. Going to attack into the commando. Not an event, not an event. Okay. Okay, so I can clear the commando. Okay, all right, I see, I see the path here. Okay. So, three to the commando, two to the commando, Uh, oh, actually, I could have done sequence that the other way around. So two the commando, then three, so I did more damage, so I can draw a card off of that. So it's another suit up. Okay. We're going to flip down. We are going to get rid of our pistol. Oh, no, we're not doing that yet because we need to suit up first. To go find Moon Girl. And of course, on our Eric Guardian. Now we're going to burn Pistol to draw two, so Groot and Salvage. Uh, we can do this without hurting ourselves. So... Three for Moon Girl. Uh, put this back on top. 
Draw three. <laughs> okay. One, two, three for Groot. Do we hurt? I mean, hmm. I think uh, I think I'm going to have to do it. Going to go down to one. Let's put out the pistol and then put out the battery pack. The pistol has three, it has two, we're going to put charges back on these. Uh, oh, we got to. Uh, we're gonna do our thwarting first. Okay. Down to one. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. And the problem is we're all out of suit ups, so we can't get Moon Girl back. Maria, I've got a plan. Make the call. Oh, we can through that, but it won't do any good. Major victory, energy, and helicarrier. Okay. Three goes on. He's going to scheme. Schemes for three. Four. Okay. First of three encounter cards. Special delivery. Uh, yep, we're gonna have to exhaust the Milano. Next one. Oh, yeah, there it is. Exactly what I was afraid was gonna happen. One goes on to pursue by the past, and he's going to scheme. Schemes for a base of three. He's already at seven, so he's going to do it anyway. Oh, my goodness. What a rough matchup that is. I mean, Ronan is just still the worst. I think I've managed to beat him, at least on camera, once with Spider-Ham, because Spider-Ham is so ridiculously powerful. I mean, we had an okay turn coming up, but, you know, that's always the, always the worry. So the one-two punch of special delivery, having to um, exhaust the Milano and then not having the Milano to be able to uh, stop dark designs from happening. Oh, but then I realized after that too, had I stopped dark designs, the third card would have been you stand accused and he would have schemed anyway so there was literally no way out of that all right well we gave it a shot um i do like this deck i think it's pretty solid and i think against many 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 other villains it would be uh, extraordinarily powerful but against ronin no still uh toughest one in the game i mean there's there's something to be said that you know maybe venom goblin uh mojo are uh Two of the, the tougher ones. But I think still, really, 
it's uh, it's Ronan to this day. Will uh, will always be I think everyone's final boss nemesis. Um, such a poorly tuned uh, encounter he was. My you, it was in the early days of the game. It was the second expansion, so things I feel have gotten a lot better since then. You, you feel like you have a, a more of a chance against Magneto, let's say, as the final boss, than you do against a lot of them. All right. Well, thanks very much for watching, and until next time, happy gaming. Thank you so much for watching Longship Gaming. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment. It will really help the channel to grow and improve. Don't forget to hit the bell icon so you'll be notified when more Longship Gaming content goes live. Until next time, happy gaming.